Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Victoria here at Radiant Moon Tarot. We are doing your daily reading for Tuesday, August 2nd, 2022. I hope this reading finds you well. If you're new to my channel, hello and welcome. If you are returning, welcome back. As always, I am super grateful for each and every one of you. So we're going to see what we've got coming in here for you guys today and uh, go from there. I am getting prepared. I've had a little bit of time off. I start my new day job tomorrow or today actually uh, on the second I start my new day job so uh, this is kind of exciting also a little bit scary but that's okay so hopefully you guys have something new and exciting in your life here as well wow we've got some beautiful energy coming out for you for tomorrow so we have introspection which is the hermit energy we've got the witch which is the magician and we have the three of cups Ooh, maybe some of you are getting some good news okay in your day ahead all right your day might start off a little bit quiet okay maybe a little bit um you know you might be lost in thought a little bit okay or you've got something that you just got to do on your own you might de need to gain some deeper insights into something okay but the hermit card does show that um perhaps you are going within to seek some answers to figure out how to do something or how to get something done okay you're trying to figure out what your goal is and once you know what your goal is i think you're going to be focused on achieving what you need to achieve today okay it's all up to you pretty much okay but you might also be dealing with a virgo person with the hermit energy all right you've got some sort of goal in mind and i think you're trying to figure out what to do with it hopefully you have some time to yourself today as well because this can be um, a card of um, being calm going within okay and uh so maybe you're meditating today as well that would all that would all be nice for you okay it's a little bit of a calm quiet energy but this does lead you into the magician so i think whatever it is that you need to do today i think first you're going to think about it first you're going to contemplate and then you're going to get to work you're going to take some action there the magician energy certainly does bring in your power your focus to get something done okay to leave no stone unturned and to really figure out how to resolve situations, how to make some progress, how to move forward. All right, when we have the magician energy, this one is the witch, because uh, this is the feminine deck. Okay, but when we do have that energy, this is your ability to create something out of nothing. This is your ability to uh, start something new and get it done, or to resolve situations that you may have to do. And you do so by being focused by using your skills, your talents to get things done, um, by using a little bit of magic. Maybe you've got some magic going on for you as well. Um, but this is also your ability to um, be resourceful. The magician energy is very resourceful. So if you don't have some information, you go find the information, you do some research. Um, you know, if you don't have the knowledge or if you need to um, be a little bit more logical, boom, you've got that energy, logic, um, figuring out the truth, okay, gaining deeper insights, all right, um, you know, if you're looking for a little bit more inspiration, or you need to be a little bit more creative, you've got that energy going on as well, you've got all of your ducks in a row, right, you need to pour your heart and soul in it, boom, you've got that going on, so you've got a lot of magic that surrounds you today, your ability to find the tools, the information, the insights that you need to get things done, Okay, energy of creation. Okay, using your talents and your skills. Very skilled energy here. But we also have the que the three of cups coming in. So it could be that you're celebrating your success. You may have some good news coming in. The three of cups is also a very social card. So perhaps you're really focused on your day ahead here because at the end of the day, you've got some good plans. You've got somewhere to be. Okay, you've got some fun to be had with that three of cups energy. Maybe you're getting together with some friends or some family uh, or you're just really excited that you've gotten something done. You've gotten something accomplished. I do feel you're getting something accomplished today. Okay, you're very much nurturing your goals today and your thoughts position. You've got the queen of pentacles. Queen of Pentacles is being focused on your goals, nurturing your dreams, getting things done. Um, your energy here is very calm, but you've got a goal in mind. There's something that you need to do, okay? This could also be that you're taking care of your own needs as well. The Queen of Pentacles, you could be getting yourself into receiving mode, so maybe you're ready to receive some information, um, some insights, okay? Or maybe there's uh, something that is being given to you today. 
all right full-on receiving mode with that queen of pentacles but this is an energy of success abundance focusing on your goals um again maybe some of you are taking care of yourself your home your family is might be what you're focused on okay or that's your main goal of the day okay um i do get a celebration a party we do have the nymph of cups here which is the page of cups so perhaps you are um planning a celebration a birthday um something maybe like someone's graduating from somewhere this may be something that does occur around the home or the workplace um and this is occupying pretty much your thoughts today okay um you might also be oh okay you might really know okay you might be thinking here oh my god i've got to clean my house before people come over holy crap and here you are just making it happen okay whatever it is that you are doing whether you're making plans you're getting something done super duper positive energy okay and i think ultimately you're feeling really good i think you're feeling really positive the nymph of cups this is the page of cups energy okay so this can certainly bring about something to do with um one of your children if you have them okay um so again maybe you're um you know maybe you're planning uh something for them okay but this can also be thinking about somebody that you love okay maybe you're feeling you could just be feeling really positive okay but you might really um be doing something nice for somebody that you care about in this energy as well okay um there may also be ha ha okay surprise party okay or you surprised yourself with something the page of cups can sometimes bring in um a bit of a surprise something unexpected as can the magician okay so maybe there is uh some surprise that either you're planning okay or maybe someone else is planning something around all right or you might get a surprise invitation something just a little bit unexpected but something very joyful and something very happy um so you do have some great great energy that is around you guys today um i love it you may also be I, I can't ignore the fact that some of you are manifesting something in now you could actually be seeing the results of some manifestations this page of cups uh perhaps you are meeting someone new new or um it could be a new friend but call, it could also be a new romantic partner there might be a little bit of a surprise of love and romance somewhere in your day today even with somebody that you are already committed to okay um maybe someone is again planning some sort of surprise that you don't currently know about but something that's actually really quite exciting for you okay but i think here that there is uh uh, I think your gut instincts are telling you, um, guiding you forward through the day with that page of cups energy. So I think your, uh, your instincts, your intuition are really helping you um, make the right choices, make the right decisions. Again, it's all centering around this magician for your day ahead. Okay, so um, think before you act could be it. Okay, um, make plans, make some decisions, and then get the ball rolling. Okay, but again, uh, there might be a little bit of a surprise that's headed your way for some of you here. But whatever it is, you are feeling positive, you are feeling fine, you are feeling good. Um, I think if you need to sort out some issues, I think you're going to be focused on solutions rather than the problem. All right, you're going to sort things out with that Queen of Pentacles energy that's coming in there. But I do have to say with that magician and that hermit card there with the pentacles and the cups, everything, um, I think some of you are preparing yourself, maybe even doing some research um, about law of attraction, about manifestation. You may be setting some intentions today, okay, um, that carry you forward. Um, you may be um, looking towards the Lionsgate portal that we've got coming up on August 8th big 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 day for manifestation and so you might be doing some research um, in regards to that you might be doing some advanced preparation if you will okay um, and uh, you might be really headed towards the right direction to use that energy um, to its fullest potential to benefit you the most okay I think you're very confident with that queen of pentacles and whatever you've got going on today and a super duper positive outlook I like it I like it a lot let's get a few more cards here shall we so what else do people need to know for their day ahead please day ahead for people watching we've got the thievery we've got good lord the house legal matters and we have short illness so i think you're trying to sort out an, uh, a solution to a problem 
okay the um, I think something is maybe not as serious as what you thought that it was gonna be and I think you are getting things back on track um, the legal matters can represent some legalities some legal situations um, the thievery card something taken away okay so um, maybe you lose some time or lose some energy you may probably have to with that magician energy have to um, really pour some energy into getting something done Done or getting something sorted out okay there could be something that um, maybe you receive some documentation or something in the mail um, something like an official paperwork or something like that with the thievery maybe something is lost you don't receive it the thievery card is a theft card so it's a loss of some of some kind or something that you are letting go of or something that's not as bad or as much as you expected it to be Okay, it could also be that something costs more than you thought that it was going to in the first place. The short illness card here um, can certainly represent a little bit of a down patch. Okay, but I think here that you've got, um, you know, something to sort out, but I think that you're going to take matters into your hands. I think you're going to sort something out and, um, you know, not let anything get the better of you today. Okay, um, again, that hermit card, right? You're trying to figure out what you need to do today. The magician, you're getting your resources together and then you've got a good outcome. Okay, so I think there is a little bit of a challenge here today, but I think here that you are taking matters under control. You are um, playing by the, by the book, playing by the rules. Okay, you probably have to get all of your ducks in a row today, that legal matters, right? We need to follow a process, follow a procedure um, in order to get things done. The house card here that's showing up in the bottom, okay, this is, I think you're feeling the warm and fuzzies today, people, okay? Now, this could be something to do with your house. Um, just saying there might be some um, some issue with your house. You try, you got to try and, you know, figure out a solution, okay? Um, and that might be your focus. Uh, the house can also represent any building card. Okay, but um, it can also represent something. Maybe you are having uh, some sort of get together at your house and you're like, oh crap, I got to get my shit together. I've got to clean it. <laughs> okay, you're sorting out some issues. You're sorting out some, uh, some challenge there. Okay, so I think there may be some information that you don't have. Um, oh my. I'm just going to grab this a little bit there. I think my... Wick has uh, gotten a little bit too close to the glass. I'm pretty sure my glass just broke on my candle. Anyway, um, there you go, punctuation mark. Uh, anyway, <laughs> so I think whatever is wrong, I think you're sorting things out today. Um, I think there may be some missing information or something um, might go astray and you really do need to fix something and sort something out there. Okay, um, this could be it to do with your house. It could be have to do with your um, place of business. All right, but this could just be you figuring out what, you know, making some plans and getting things sorted out today. Okay, I think you're maintaining a positive outlook. The house does bring in some um, some stability into your world. So I think you've been, I think you're going to be feeling as though you can get things done. Okay, it's a very positive energy um, to emit. There may be a um, person around you who this may revolve around. The good Lord can be somebody who is... Um, uh, who is mature, someone who is uh, a good help, um, a helping hand. They are generally have good intentions. Um, they may be someone who you have on your mind. Maybe they can give you some really good advice, okay? And especially if there's any kind of um, paperwork that's involved in your day today, this may be someone who can um, help and support you in some way. But this could just be you with that Queen of Pentacles. This could just be you taking a calm, mature outlook on things. Something might go a little bit sideways, but you're like, no worries, man. I'm going to figure it out. Um, you're feeling very secure and stable in what you need to get done. And you are sorting out some issues and you're getting things. And that gives you that reason to celebrate. Okay. So, but the good Lord can be someone who can actually give you some advice or some help or someone along the way, or there may be even someone that you partner up with in your day. But this could also be, if you are planning a celebration or something, this could also represent the person that you're doing that for. Okay. Someone who is maybe a little bit older than you, but someone who is very calm, very mature, very loving, very caring. Okay. This could actually be like a family man or something. So maybe something to do, um, you know, with your workplace or again, something to do with your home. All right, but I think there that you are getting things together, you are sorting things out, and no worries. 
okay? So I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna take care of what appears to be a broken candle holder now. Um, and uh, good thing the wax didn't go all over the place. That would be fun. Anyways, so I'm going to leave that there for you guys. I hope there's something here that resonated with you today. I hope you have a fantastic day. Um, and um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.